Fish. Hi, my name is Kim McCosker, author of Four Ingredients Kids. And when writing Four Ingredients Kids, I went to people just like these three little beautifuls and asked them what were their favourite ever recipes. It was their answers that make up the 80 plus recipes that you will find in Four Ingredients Kids. So let's ask the experts. Hamilton, what are some of your favourite recipes in Four Ingredients Kids? Volcanic eggs and strawberries. And grape garden. And strawberry garden. Volcanic eggs and strawberry garden. So how do you make, for example, strawberry gardens? You get a strawberry, put it on a stick, then dip it in melted chocolate, then put sprinkles on it, then freeze it. Then once it's all frozen, you get to eat it. Yum, that sounds beautiful. You know, you could use strawberries, you could use grapes, you could use bananas, whatever fruits in season where you're living. And Morgie, what about you? What did you like in Four Ingredients Kids? What recipes? I'll, I like the um, hamburgers for lunch. <gasps> Cheese and bacon hamburgers, they're divine, aren't they? M Good idea. M&M slices for your lunchboxes. Oh yeah, M&M bar for your lunchbox, mm -hmm. great idea. And Only three simple ingredients. And sticky lamb chops. Oh, can you remember how to make the sticky lamb chops? We have soy sauce. Yep. Sweet chilli sauce. Yes. Um, mix them together and pour them on your lamb. Put them on your lamb chops and cook them. Oh, see, so easy. Every recipe in Four Ingredients Kids made with just four or fewer ingredients. In fact, there's one, your favourite recipe, Mr. Flinney, the soda pop cupcakes with just two simple ingredients. Honestly, the most of the ingredients you're probably going to have in your cupboard as you listen to this as well. So if you're like me and you're a busy mum and you're looking for recipes that you can make that your family, your kids will eat, look no further. It is all within the pages of Four Ingredients Kids. Enjoy.